Working with cerebral palsy, I have found that often the most simplest task can be the most challenging. One example for me, among others, be lifting heavy items. Whether it be a bag full of groceries or a box full of items ready for storage, I have not found an adequate solution to allow me and the item to get from point A to point B safely. So after a few months of doing some research, some product research, to see if there was items that could help me out, and doing some field testing to make sure I can do this safely, I've come up with a great solution that I think will, will help anyone that wants to be more independent and not have to rely on others for help. Okay, so basically what you're going to do here is you're going to put the item on, the, on like a top step, for example. This is a box here. So I'm gonna put, I put it on the top step and I go down three steps like I am here. I put the item on the top step. I use my left arm, my non-dominant arm, as a crutch, putting all my weight into it. And what I do is I take my dominant arm, see, all my weight is on my left side, and I, I just reach for the item, pull it down, in this case it's a heavy box, pull it down to the first step off the landing, and I will go down one step, making sure my right arm, I'm holding onto the railing here, and once I get secure, I then take the weight of my left arm, and my left side again, excuse me, and I go down another step. And then once I get to the next stair, I go down another step. Until I am all the way. And once I get to about the third, second or third step, I can, I can safely not have to move the box down the step and get down to the ground floor and then, and then put the item on a, on a shelf or whatnot in the main, in the area that I want to. Now to bring it up, it's basically the same thing. So what I'll do is I will take the box with me here. I will put it on a shelf here. Let's say I want to, I would say I want to bring it up now. So I, I carry it one handed. It's, if it's a bigger box, I will not do this because it is not safe. It's gotta be something that I feel that I can manage. So if you're going to attempt this, please make sure it's something that you can manage. Okay, I'm gonna put it about um, one, two, three, four, maybe five stairs up. There's about six or seven stairs here, depending on what you feel is comfortable. Then I'm going to go up the first step, right foot, left foot for me, right, my right side is my dominant side, and I'm going to then do basically the same thing I did going down with the weight. Make sure that the weight on my, uh, the, the weight is right now going up is, is distributed, of course. But once I stop and I and I put the item on another stair, all the weight is focused on my left side of my body. I'm using my left arm as a crutch to make sure I do not fall and I feel secure. If I feel I'm going to fall, like I said, I don't do this. And I grab on as quickly as I can and not injure myself. Okay, so I go up another stair. Go ahead and go one or two, depending on what I feel. I'm going to go up two. So once I'm there, I use the weight distribution again. Just in halfway through the staircase here, I make sure that my right side, my right side is free in case I need it, and the left side here, my non-dominant side, has all the weight through it. Okay, so then I put the box, lift it up my right hand, put it on landing, go up the stairs. At that point, once I'm up, I kind of, you know, for lack of a better terms, drag myself up. And my so my left arm is kind of dangling. It might look a little weird, but I have full I have full control of my right side. So I just go like this. I don't have to have my left arm on this on this banister. And once I get to a good point, again, make sure that I have my left hand secure. There might be a piece of wood or something you can use if it if it is an exposed staircase or whatnot. You know, if you have enough leverage and you just want to push your item to off to a safe distance and get yourself up, in this case, the flight of stairs. I'm gonna get to the landing here and then I can pull, I can pick up the item and there we go. So that is how I safely take items up and down the stairs using a one-handed method. Thank you guys for watching. Have a nice day.